Hallelujah to Jesus. We bless the name of the Lord for another day. I thank you, O God, for another opportunity granted unto us. Today I pray for you and your household according to the word of the living God. That God will move you from every area in which you are to a place of favor. That the Lord will move you from the road of destruction to the right path, which is the road of your destiny in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Today I'm praying for that one that is sharing tears. I'm praying for that one that is sick. I'm praying for that one that is confused. I'm praying for that one that has lost a sense of direction and purpose in their life. Today I'm praying for that one that is down. I pray for that one that has been betrayed. I pray for that one that is in the place where you have no hope and expectation has been eluded in every aspect of your life. Today by the man of the blood of the Lamb, I pray that may the Lord visit you in every state in which you are. May the Lord change your circumstances. May the Lord change your situation. May the Lord lift his hands upon you in the name of the Lord Jesus. I pray that this day will God create a new opportunity for you and you will walk in the light of your testimony. This day where your strength has failed, the Lord shall help you. I pray that may the hand of the Lord be strong upon you. That situation putting questions mark in your life shall be shaken and be taken away from you and from your entire household by the power of the Holy Ghost. I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus that this day may the Spirit of the living God go ahead of you. Today may the Spirit of the living God speak for you. That evil sword that draws and cuts you from your destiny. Today I pray that that sword that have taken over your family, that infirmity that have taken over your family, those satanic altars that are fighting against your lineage by reason of the blood that have been sacrificed upon the pedestal in your house. I pray that may the hand of the Lord speak for you this very day in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every schemes and machinations of the enemy against your life today will bring you to a halt in the name of the Lord Jesus. Today I pray for you and your household according to the word of the living God. That may the Lord continue to favor you and uphold you in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. As you step out today, God shall bring you back home fulfilled and with joy. Fulfilled and full of joy in the name of the Lord Jesus. Every situation shall work to your favor. The Lord will keep you and your family from trouble and from every evil plot. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the angels of the Lord will locate you and your household with good news. No matter what happens this very day, you and your family will always be undertaken by the cover of God and by the grace of God. Every enemy that appears as a friend, today may the hand of the Lord put them to shame. May the Lord expose your enemies before you and may they make mistakes that will expose them. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, your wounds shall be healed. Your tears shall be wiped away. Your stolen blessings shall be restored in multiple fold. In the name of the Lord Jesus and in the mighty power of his arm, this very day I pray that may the spirit of the living God go ahead of you. According to the word of God in Genesis chapter 8 and verse 1, And God remembered Noah and every living thing that all the cattle that were with him in the ark. And God made the wind to pass over the earth, and the waters were as wedge. I pray that in the name of Jesus, today may the Lord remember you as he caused Noah to be remembered. Today may the Lord remember your affliction. May the Lord remember your pain. May the Lord remember your sorrow. May the Lord remember your anguish. May the hand of the Lord grant you speedy recovery and re favor in the name of the Lord Jesus today. May you lift up your hands to the hills because your help has come to you. And your help is in the name of the Lord. Today may the name of the Lord speak for you and may the Lord favor you. In the name of the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed with thanksgiving. In Jesus' name, we call it done. This is Apostle Dr. Jerry Otin from Global Harvest Ministries Worldwide. Remember, you are a property of the Holy Ghost. Satan, back off in Jesus' name. Amen.